Hi, so today we'll be trying to check how to deploy a WhatsApp user bot on our favorite Heroku. So the developer is Wake. Uh, I'm just showing how to deploy this on Heroku. The developer has made it very easy. We just need to click on this button. and fill this values mm. this I will come to it later so the developer is a person of Turkey so all the languages are there but it is also supports English so we will leave all the values to default the Roku app name is the same value what we entered here now to obtain the Heroku API key, we need to go to account settings, click on reveal and copy this and paste it here. Uh, instead of language, we will select EN. We can select any of the available languages given here. Only these are default values. Now the new PG, if the user wants, can go and fill the value so that the background removal options are enabled in the whatsapp user boot we are not filling anything now to obtain the asana session um, we need to have installed whatsapp so i have this installed <laughs> now what we need to do is i will share the uh, this rpn link in the description so that you can click on that and just run this command just click on the whatsapp web add a new session so when we click on that uh, you can see that we got one setting we will copy that and paste it here then click on the deploy app button So this will take some time to install all the dependencies and to build the application it will take some time. So how this works is uh, it's a JavaScript application so you can verify the source code here. Uh, try reading this to understand what is being done so it is a modular pluggable user boot and it's the only user boot currently working for whatsapp so you can read the source code and understand the what what functionality is being used in the user boot till then we will wait for the app to get built So this will take some time. We filled only these three values. One is the app name, the Sena session. I will share the link in the description of this video. 
and Oroku Ipeki, Oroku Apple, the language. Only these values are mandatory. Rest are all de by default filled to default values. Now we will click on the Manage App button. Go to the Resources tab. Click on Enable the Dino. Then open View Logs. So you can see it is successfully loaded. You can see this message. Now you in WhatsApp you can type a line. Dot is the command handler we had set. So WhatsApp has various issues. Like unlike Telegram, WhatsApp does not support editing of messages. So what a developer has done is like he is deleting the current message and sending a new message. And to get the list of available commands, we will type this command. So these are the available commands. If, it, if there are multiple people in the group, we can use ban as a reply. We can add someone using a phone number. We can promote another person as an admin. We can demote any other admin. We can mute other users. We can mute the group chat. We can get the invite link. Sorry, a spelling mistake. So we got the invite link. And we can execute Linux, no Linux commands like. You can search for a song. And it will get download and upload. Okay. So WhatsApp does not allow editing the messages. That's why the developer has to delete and send new message every time. Spamming the chat. And you can also search for youtube videos you can select one link and download the video using this command We can get the weather information of a city. So all cool features and since it is pluggable, anybody can create their own plugins and make your WhatsApp awesome. So that's all. If you have any suggestions, you can join the Telegram channel and group and support this initiative. That's all. Thank you.